Some town leaders want to transform Woodlawn Beach into an even bigger summertime destination. News 4's Lori Schultz is live for you in the town of Hamburg today. Lori? That's right, Nalina. I was hoping to go to the beach today, and here I am. I'm at Woodlawn Beach, which is just behind this, uh, beyond this pavilion here. A quick little walk on a very well-maintained boardwalk, I must add. This beach has been closed for the past couple of years. Now it's open, it's looking good, and people are excited. Alexia is loving the soft, sandy beach. While Devron Holland's family came for the view. It's lovely because, you know, we come out to the beach, you know, get our feet wet, you know, and enjoy ourselves. Woodlawn Beach State Park in the town of Hamburg opened this weekend, hopefully to a new beginning that keeps the beach open more than it's closed as in past years. It's the first area state park now operated by the host community. And Deputy Town Supervisor Amy Ziegler says the town has big plans. We think that this is going to be a community destination, not just for the residents of Hamburg, but for all of our surrounding neighbors, for weddings, for parties, for graduations. The beach has a bathhouse, snack bar, and room for banquets. Restaurateur Tucker Curtin will run concessions. I hear Caribbean style attractions. What yes. is that? Well, Caribbean style attractions. You know, you remember when you were on vacation last time and you were down on the beach and somebody brought you uh, your food and your drinks and you got to relax and you were pampered a little bit? That's the type of experience that we're going to deliver right here in, in, on Lake Erie. The snack bar will open next weekend. Lifeguards are already on duty. Day two is going really well. We're having a good time. People are out enjoying the sun on the beach. The water's great. Obviously, the success of the beach depends largely on Mother Nature. Poor water quality kept people away in the past. We are continuing to partner with the state of New York in um, evaluating methods that we can use to alleviate any of the problems. But no problems for Sydney Robinson and her friends who enjoyed this day on the beach. We're looking into sunset and Mickey Rats, but it's far away and we want somewhere closer and it's just quiet and nice to be here. And Lori Schultz back live now at Woodlawn Beach. The state still owns the property and the beach, but the town is going to run it for the next 10 years. I did hear a couple people griping about the admission fee, $5 a vehicle, but then they came back, took their complaint back after being on the beach. Live in the town of Hamburg, Lori Schultz, News 4.